Before digital, we had to use this stuff called film, which is a plastic backing, and it's coated with chemicals that uh, are sensitive to light. When light hits them, it changes the chemical making up of this plastic. Now, this part here has already been exposed to light. It's useless. But inside the light-proof canister is the rest of the film, which is still good. So we take our camera, we open up our camera, and we place the film canister in here like this. Now it has little sprocket holes, and a, you notice this part here is kind of tapered to help feed it into this little slot up here. Uh, as you can see, it's a little bit of a pain. And then you have to make sure that the sprocket holes are engaged by this little gear thingy. Again, this part here has been exposed, so it's useless, but we advance the film enough to make sure that it's tightly wrapped. We close the back. We have to advance it several times to get past the already exposed part. Now we should be up to a good part of film that hasn't been exposed yet. And we're ready to use it, just like a regular camera. Now after you take the picture, when, you, when the shutter snaps, that one little frame of film, area of film, which becomes a frame, has been exposed to light, so it's changed the chemical makeup of that film. After you complete the roll of exposures, it has to be taken to a, a lab and put through some liquid chemicals which develop the film, which bring out the picture, as it were. And that, that becomes a negative of the film. And that negative, in turn, has to be put onto an enlarger, which actually shoots light through that negative onto the white printing paper, which becomes the positive, the actual print. But that print also has to be chemically processed. So it's a long involved procedure uh, to get an actual print. And the camera operates the same, shutter sp uh, aperture, shutter speeds. And the lens, you know, focuses the light onto that one frame of film and creates the picture. So kids, that's how your granddaddy used to do it. There's a lot of people like that satisfactory little, just something cool about that sound. Even the digital cameras now have that built in, that sound, because people like it.